Hey guys, I'm actually going to run some last minute errands for Easter. Um, I'm definitely gonna go to Walmart. I might go to Pop Shelf. I don't know if I'm gonna run into Home Goods because I need to get a couple things for my office. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna go do that. Here's Loki. He went for a car ride this morning. We went and got him. <laughs> That's his favorite word, my bad. Um, he's like, again? Uh, to get him some food. But yeah. So today's video is going to be more of like a vlog style. I'm going to run my errands. So if you want to come, come along with me, let's go. something black in my office. I need some new um, silverware. It's pretty. I'm gonna go for this one. How adorable is this? for Micah's Easter basket. Heidi Swap at, what's this place called again? Pop Shelf. Wow. These are Micah's favorites. All right, I'm at Walmart and I'm just kind of getting some random things, but I definitely need some floor cleaner. I think I gotta go make my way all the way to the other side. All right, I'm back home. I don't think I got very many clips at all from each store because it was just really packed it's the day before Easter. So, um, makes sense. And I just, you know, didn't want to be in like everybody's way, but I'll show you guys what I got from each store. So I did get something from Home Goods, Pop Shelf, and Walmart, and those were the three stores I did want to go to today. So with Home Goods, I didn't find the planter that I wanted. I wanted one that was black for my office. My office is actually coming together really soon. I should have it released next week. I also have my entryway in the media room finished, but I wasn't sure if I wanted to group that with my office and just do the three rooms together or if I should do them separately, comment, let me know. Do you want separate videos? Do you just want me to combine them all in one? The reason why I ask is because sometimes you might want like one certain room and um, it makes it easy to be like searchable, if that makes sense. I mean, I guess I could put all three rooms in the same title, um, but anyways, whatever. So I didn't find that from Home Goods, but I did, luckily really kind of only walk out with like what i had intended to get so all right so something i really needed were some new silverware 20 piece set forged stainless steel talks about the quality of this and that's really kind of what i was looking for i really don't know what to look for honestly when it comes to silverware i feel like in my personal experience they all seem to like especially the butter knives I don't know, does anybody know why this happened? But they just end up getting like this weird cake, rusty stuff on it. I don't know why that happens. Um, I don't know if it says that it's, yeah, dishwasher safe. It never needs polishing. So there's that, but for whatever reason, I always have a lot of trouble with my silverware, like coming out clean clean like this so anyways i needed a new set we'll see how this one works it was 39.99 also she's down the hall and i've got some stuff for her easter basket so i'm gonna say she her and you guys will know who i'm talking about um i got this for her easter basket she's really into 
this in her room. Um, here's the price. I really like how it was packaged. I just thought it was really pretty. So I'm gonna place it just like that in her basket. Which by the way, if you guys um, saw my five below video, I'll link it down below. I got her the cutest like Easter basket. And my whole plan was to do like an all white theme. Yeah, that went out the window. That went out the window like a week ago. Um, but also I haven't found that basket because I just moved. No idea which box it's in. And so I had to order another basket and it's coming in today. I spent a total of $91.95 at Home Goods, by the way, but $40 of that was the silverware. So I got the candles and then I got Loki. I was like, Loki's got to get an Easter basket. So I got him this cute little toy. I look for very specific toys now that I know he'll not only play with, but he won't, he sees it. He already sees it. Um, but I know that he can't like really break or get the stuffing like this has some stuffing that he could possibly get into but this toy might last longer than the others $5.99 anyways I got that for him and I was hoping I was going to find him an Easter basket and I did Micah look at Loki's Easter basket yeah in the checkout aisle of home goods that's why you guys i don't think saw a clip of it um 9.99 and i was really hoping i was gonna find one and it's super cute i can save it and this could be like loki's easter basket every year so i am gonna put his easter basket together in this video too i would do micah's so unless her basket delivers before i finish this video maybe that will be in here but let's just kind of like get all of his stuff together so I got that and then for her basket, I was like, you know what? She loves these and this was $7.99. I like the name of it. They also come in different colors, but it's the same exact scent, which I thought was really interesting. So they had like a beautiful, like vibrant bluish purple. I wish you guys could smell it, but I love when they have the that kind of wick because it like crackles and it sounds really good it says it's a soy wax blend and has a wooden wick that's what that is it is cassis i don't know what that is cassis orange pineapple lychee raspberry violet and jasmine the house i just thought it was really cute love the, the handle this is a lemongrass tea milk house candle co don't know who that is it is 100% all natural soy wax infused with beeswax and it's certified paraben free. Made in the USA, this was $12.99 for this guy right here. I might actually get into like making my own candles. I might get into that. If you're interested, let me know if you want me to like share that process. I watch a lot of videos on it and it looks pretty easy. So got that for the house and that's it for home goods also let me show you one quick little item that i didn't get in today's shopping but i went earlier this morning like i said to get loki dog food and they had the cutest little treats in the bakery section so i got him some and i got him this cute little carrot cookie treat thing and then i got him this little yellow golf cart they had a green golf cart they had a red one i decided to go with yellow and <laughs> these were the little treats that i got him so we're gonna put this in his uh basket as well okay so we'll do that at the end now let's move over to pop shelf i only got three things but you know did its job i just kind of wanted to see if there was any other little knickknack cute things that I could put in her Easter basket for tomorrow and I found these if you watch her YouTube channel you maybe you know I don't know she she does videos where she like marks up and does stuff with her books so I just thought she could use these like how cool are those five dollars and then these are her favorite so put those in her basket as well and then i got me this brush i found it very interesting i thought i'd give it a try this is the detangle oval cushion brush and it's made from discarded coconut shells so we'll see we'll see how well this works i got that for me 
so that's it from pop shelf and now i'll show you guys a couple of things i got from walmart so this was on my list i knew i needed to get this today now i did get a steam mop for those of you who watch like my vlog channel um but i got this to just kind of quickly get loki slobber off the floors whenever i'm making his dinner or his breakfast he salivates a lot i mean he is bubbling it's like it is a faucet so it's just something for me to like quickly boop boop you know i don't want to get the steam mop and do all that the steam mop i'm really using to disinfect the floors with um because of the heat but like this i'll just like you know quickly clean stuff and then <clears throat> this is really random but i'll share it anyways i got these outdoor solar lights um just to like spotlight some of the trees i'm just a really big curb appeal kind of girl and then um i also got these which if you know you know these were actually incredibly cheap like for all of these safari little erasers i think it was like four dollars i got these because i'm collecting little erasers for my niece and then i'm gonna send her like a whole like um crayon box full of erasers because i just like used to collect them as a kid so i thought maybe she would find that fun the other item that contributed to the high price at walmart were these vitamins so i already got these for loki but i got them from amazon i didn't even know that they sold the same brand at walmart so i was just about to run out of his so i was like oh you know what i'll just get these and you know what i'm gonna put them in his basket maybe he loves them so why don't we just throw it in this little basket um then i got him some tennis balls but i got him the like extra large ones i don't know how much these were but they're gonna go in his basket and i got him a brush so loki has very short coarse hair and um so he doesn't really need like brushing like other dogs do but i definitely saw this side i don't know about this side he just doesn't have long hair but i'm thinking this side he'll really like so i got that to add to his basket and then this is so like this is so cute but i found this little keychain i'll just show you guys now you're probably wondering like why this dog but micah loves this dog and i just thought it would be cute i don't know um to give to her because when she moves out on her own she's gonna get a dog so there's that and then i decided to get some nail polish i really want to start like taking better care of my toenails i don't usually paint my nails themselves so i got these for my toes and i went with the sally hansen insta dry this color is called why can i not read this alternate realty okay um this one's called fast and fuchsia wait black to black were they supposed to do like a fast and furious spin with these alternate reality i think is what they were trying to go with this one alternate reality yeah but it's like t t e a you can't see that so i'm not even gonna try <clears throat> so anyways i really liked these colors for my toes and then i wanted to get a base and top coat and this one is like a two in one so i got that and that's that's the damage for today um but i did go with the goal of getting like the swiffer the silverware um the solar lights and of course loki's basket so let's go ahead and put his basket together So I've moved into my office and that sound is actually the heater from my little fireplace. I'm gonna turn it off just in case. It's just like bad audio. But 
I'm just like buying time until Micah's Easter basket comes. So I thought I'd share with you guys at least what I'm putting in it if the basket just doesn't make it into today's video. So I went ahead and gathered everything that I've been like collectively getting for her. So it's just a thing now that she always gets a, je a jelly cat like and I went with the peach, so adorable. I hope she doesn't hear me. I don't think, I think she's still back in her room, but she loves jelly cats. So, and then of course you guys saw this in this haul. Um, let's see, I'm just gonna put this right here. You guys saw that um, pop shelf. You saw the candle. And then, um, things and then i of course was like let me get her some more accessories for her nintendo switch like she loves this thing i got it for her for her birthday um and uh she has so many games so she doesn't need any more games but i thought accessories might be fun for it so i got her this accessory with the yellow and the pink handle she has another like purple and something or i don't know what color she has but i don't think she has this one so i got her that and i got her a clear case for it i don't she doesn't actually have a case for it so i went with clear so it comes with like the back part and then the part that you slide over these just to like protect it a little bit more you know she's kind of at this age where it's getting a little trickier to find cute little things to put in her Easter basket. I wouldn't say this is like, you know, very realistic, but she just doesn't eat very much candy. So this is like the only candy. So, you know, um, so I'm just kind of like getting other things that I know she'll like. Then I got these. I'm hoping she's going to love them, but let me just show you what they are. But they're thumb grips for her Nintendo Switch. So they go... They go on this part. You slide them over these because your thumb goes over that part. So, and you, she can like add cute little, and I was kind of trying to go with this color theme right here. So I don't know, like a cute little spring thing. Um, and then I got her another pen for her iPad. Got all this from Amazon. And of course, this, which I think is probably gonna be her favorite thing. Super lucky girl, also the product of being an only child. Um, so yeah, I mean, Loki's my child too. Anyways, like I said, I don't know if her basket is gonna make it by the time this, I need to put this video up. But if it doesn't, I decided, so I couldn't find her Easter basket I got from Five Below. And then I was like, you know what? Let me get her something where she can actually take with her if she wanted to like go on a little walk or a picnic. And so it's like a little, a little picnic basket with a super cute lining. I'll throw up a picture of it. So if it doesn't make it into today's video, I will for sure post it on my Instagram. So follow me over my Instagram. But um, otherwise, I will just throw up a picture of what that basket looks like. And that's it. That's Easter um, for my two babies. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and coming along with me. Happy Easter. And I will see you guys soon. Bye.